Hi everyone, this is Shela and we are reading our very special book, The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People by Stephen R. Covey. And this is part one. We are going to read page 26. As my study took me back through 200 years of writing about success, I noticed a startling pattern emerging in the content of the literature because of our own pain and because of similar pain I had seen in the lives of other people I had worked with through the years, I began to feel more and more that much of the success literature of the past 50 years was superficial. It was filled with social image, consciousness, techniques and quick fixes with social band-aids and aspirin that addressed acute problems and sometimes even appear to solve them but temporarily and left the underlying chronic problems untouched to faster and resurface time and again so when he talks about character ethic personality ethic and the concept of paradigm in this part of the book he explains all these terminologies with examples stories and his self experiences he further talks about how personality ethic was adapted and came to our society he says shortly after world war one the basic view of success shifted from the character ethic to what we might call the personality ethic. Success became more a function of personality, of public image, of attitudes and behaviors, skills and techniques that lubricate the process of human interaction. This personality ethic essentially took two paths. One was human and public relation techniques and the other was positive mental attitude. Some of this philosophy was expressed in inspiring and sometimes valid maxims such as Your attitude determines your attitude. Smiling wins more friends than frowning. Whatever the mind of man can conceive and believe it can achieve. And he further talks about personality ethic and character ethic and uh, he goes into detail one of his uh, uh, quote that he mentions is by Emerson it goes what you are shouts so loudly in my ears I cannot hear what you say. So we are what our character is. According to Steven, we cannot change with personality ethics. We can use them for success in today's society, but it is not the basis, actual basis of our true success. So we will talk more about paradigm and how paradigm changes the way we see something in our lives and the way we perceive different things in our lives. So wait for the next video. Thank you for watching this video. And if you like this video, please uh, subscribe and like and comment thank you so much